These children in the village of Shinga in the southeastern Democratic Republic of Congo have a newfound enthusiasm for their lessons. Perhaps because their school didn't even exist before last year when this tiny hamlet was supplied with electric power for the first time. For locals, the difference has been like night and day. Il y a avant et après. Avant, le milieu était de pourvu de l'énergie électrique. Et il faisait sombre. Nous vivions pleinement dans un milieu purement rural. Mais avec ce que nous voyons actuellement, il y a un développement. Le village était village, mais pour le moment, nous tendons à l'urbanisation. Donc avant, c'était le noir. Mais maintenant, nous sommes éclairés. Of Congo's 70 million people, more than 8 in 10 have no access to electricity. Although there are power lines serving the major cities, adapting that high voltage current for local household use would require huge substations, which just aren't practical for scattered rural populations. But Shinga is one of seven villages trialling a new technical innovation run by the national utility company Snell and developed by engineers at ABB, a micro substation that lets local villages use this power on a completely new scale. And what we did is we minimised everything. Instead of installing huge substations that cost a lot of money, that are, are, are huge solutions, uh, what we did is we, we kind of bypassed all that installing one transformer, one single phase transformer directly under a power line which, which provides enough electricity to cover an area, let's say 1,500 households without a problem, which is uh, huge for um, areas like Congo or other African republics where they have power lines running overhead but actually nothing from them. The seven villages involved in the trial have already become local hubs, with markets springing up and Congolese travelling to consult the medical staff here instead of relying on traditional herbal medicine. But the biggest thing, say local residents, are the electric lights that mean increased safety and security after dark. For a country that's been marked by conflict and colonialism, that's a vital step on the path to development. As it is elsewhere in Africa, where access to electricity is a major driver for the growth of industry, education and medicine. Those backing this trial, including the European Investment Bank, say that ABB's micro substation technology could be a key part of the solution, creating a brighter, safer future for Africa.